This is me getting dropped by Ari Clow. He's another professional triathlete that came down from Seattle, Washington to Vancouver to train with Evan, Josh, and me. The past couple months, we've been flooded with rain. So once we saw a weekend that was sunny and great temperature, we decided to meet up. I was super excited because I've been training alone most of my time. I'm here in Vancouver with Ari Clow and Josh Monda and we're about to hit a 7,000 yards, 7,000 meter swim. They're gonna hit a 7,000 meter swim. More for you. You're, you're gonna do like 7,600. And I'm do, doing 76, maybe 8,000 meters of swimming. This is an Australian influence swim. Set construction inspired by JR. Apparently we couldn't film in the pool, so didn't get any footage. Now we got our bike set up for a two hour easy bike ride. You know what I forgot? What's that? <laughs> yeah. We'll grab one from uh, Evan. Bike That's funny, out. I was thinking about that too on the way over here. I was like, oh, did I have a helmet? From like 1982. Is it <laughs> I'm just kidding, they have other ones. <laughs> <laughs> it was a little tight. Not only my computer mouse, it's a piece of I would take Iron Man for all their work. Just get it figured nice. out before tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Dang, sorry, man. No. That's all good, yeah. Yeah. The BFC. What's the saddle? It's like metal. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is day number two, and today we have 3050 from the diving block. One build and the second one is sprint fast. <laughs> now take that. Second interval, and 35 seconds for me. First one. Oh, you think you're so much better than us, Simon? <laughs> <laughs> you're so much better at swimming. I mean, you're more than welcome to try 35. Wait, what is this? <laughs> Simon said I was swimming so well that he needs to put the wetsuit on so he can keep up with me. Sailfish wetsuit? Pretty fast I hear actually. Yeah. yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Sometimes you gave you up. Gotta, I gave up entirely. <laughs> you just gotta uh, fold. Sometimes. Fold while you're not that far behind. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta quit while you're behind. <laughs> <laughs> He's got to pull 20 times. Dude. There you go, come on. 30 minutes. Oh. <laughs> One hour later.
egg. You gotta get me flipping my pancake next. Let's go! Very nice. <laughs> Why am I breaking everything today? Oh my god. Look at this! What is this? <laughs> I was just trying to vlog about how we're like oh doing breakfast god. and Evan, after breaking his wetsuit, <laughs> broke is... the spatula. Should I ride outside today? Uh, yeah. Maybe don't ride touch your bike. bike. I did not touch my bike. Oh god, this is gonna be so Come bad. Come on, Evan. This is gonna be so bad. Here we go. Come on, just trust it. Trust it. Just got done with the bike. Evan and Ari kind of pushed a little on the hill. I could not keep up. I think they were going. We were going threshold. 400 plus watts. Half iron watts. I am pretty fatigued, but I just kept at like 280, 290 watts which initially they said they were doing 70.3 pace. I never said that. <laughs> Someone did. So that's what I held. And now I'm going to do a 10-ish mile run while they do 15 something mile, a long run. But if I feel good, I'm going to keep keep running. So, you ready? Famous last words. <laughs> up doing 1.5 miles for the first 12 minutes they were doing about 3 minute 20 second per kilometer pace I just couldn't keep up and the second one I did 2 by 800 coming in about 240 and then 243 I think and then now I just did 2 by 400 on the third rep it's crazy to see how how fast these guys are and uh, just gotta keep grinding away on the run but one day, I know I'll get there. Day three of camp. One and a half hours of swimming, maybe two. We'll see how long we get in the water for. Into five plus hours on the bike and a 30 minute runoff. So this is the longest day. The past two days have been pretty hard, but we'll see what happens. <laughs> I was gonna let us do Oh, now I'm free. I for a long no! time. <laughs> Please tell me Simon. Yes! <laughs> Simon took it! Yes! <laughs> oh, uh, well deserved. Yeah, there you go. The yeah, least amount of ball. Hey! It's <laughs> know her? Oh, really? Yeah, she's been over my ass for dinner. Okay. Oh, and, uh, and it's a super weird story. Well, have a good run, guys. Yeah. Right. Yes, sir. Good work, Josh. So we were just talking about the KOM on a Strava segment. It's the Michael Myers time trial course that I did last weekend. About halfway through the bike, we decided to go for it. So we each took turns pulling. These guys are so strong. I took the least amount of pull, probably two and a half minutes or something. But at the finish, I decided to go back a little bit and let those guys go. But I ended up with the KOM, not the proudest, but it is what it is. Ari, I think, deserved to have it. After the bike, it was like five hour, 10 minute total riding time. 
probably like six hours of total time outside. I was gonna run 30 minutes, but I had no energy at all. So I just called it, called the weekend. I, I just hit 31 hours of training for this week. So it's enough. Huge, huge thanks to Matt and Cassie for staying out there for the whole day and just filming us. These video clips aren't possible because of them. So I just wanna thank you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this Ironman training video. Oceanside is coming up the 70.3 on April 6th and Ironman Texas is the main goal April 27th. All right, until next time.